Oh, hey there. Today we're going to derp around with some redstone, making a nice uh, um, sorting system. we got our mob farm going here like crazy. I had to lower it down a level from the first video, but that's fine. Happens all the time, right? <laughs> and anyway, let's get started with this um, sorting system. If I can remember how to make it. I may be cutting a bunch because I'll probably forget what I'm supposed to do, but let's just hope I don't. Because you know how that is, you just end up cutting and not cutting and... Uh, it's awful. So I need some torches here first off. That doesn't make a torch. Uh -huh. So, uh... Whew. I've been thinking about, uh... The new snapshots coming out looks really, really awesome. Well, I'm glad they're finally adding some kind of magical things. Um, that's kind of neat. Ah. Okay, let's get into the redstoning of all this stuff. So first off, I'm gonna have to do. I kind of got the the layout. I made it a little bigger here just to make it fun. I didn't want to make a compact or whatever. So what I have to do is I have to set three droppers. Two like this. Two like this. And then sneak over here. And one like this. So there's our hopper set up right now. Or not our hopper, our dropper. You know. And then you set one dropper against that bottom one. And then you can put a chest here if you wanted to do an actual sorting system. But seeing as I want to automate this drops, I'm going to do that so then all the drops come straight into the dropper. Now, that's not what I wanted. Now I'm going to throw a, a regular chest on here just just in case I get some overflow items or something that I want to just put in there. And I need to get a comparator now. And some redstone repeaters. So what this does is it sends a redstone signal and you put it into this block. And then this goes up like this. Where's my redstone? And then we set this back here on one tick. So just right click it once like that. So that sets up our anytime something comes in here, it's gonna come out here and spit out that way. So now we need hoppers. Again. So one, two, three, four, five. So they're, see they're all facing that way. Now what we can do is we can add our I'm awake here. I'm awake. Yes, we had our uh, stairs because we're going to add chests along here. So one chest, two chest. I'm going to go grab our trap chests. Okay, so um, now what happens is we take these, oop, we drop the hoppers, no. We grab the hoppers like this, 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 and this, and we're going to be able to get in here. Now we need to add, uh, before we put the ne next set of hoppers on, we have to, any chest we're sorting items into, we're going to add a redstone torch to. And now we shift on this. Okay. Now I think we just need the three here. And 
Now, how does that go again? Hmm. Okay. I'm trying to think how this redstone stuff works. I'm still new at it, okay? <laughs> but. I'll go right back to that in a second. Just wanna. And we're done. No. Okay. So that chest is good now in the end, but uh, I gotta figure out these. I think this this is supposed to go up one higher. Yeah, that's how that's how it works. I need some more stone. So I've been getting lots of levels here while I've been building up here. It's been. Uh, Yeah, I know, I remember. Okay. Now it's time for the comparators. Oh. Damn it. I cannot remember this. I had it all worked out. I'll be right back. All right, here, here it is. Now I figured it out. Okay, so that works that way. Now we get the comparators out. It's a very simple thing to create your redstone. Now we go like this, like this, like this. Now, what we need to do is we need to get our items that we want to sort. We need 22 of each item we're sorting. So using this on like a diamond chest or whatever is a little bit expensive, but if you're making a sorting system, you're already and uh, kind of uh, in God mode here, so. Okay, the first thing we want is probably arrows. So you do this, this, and this. And second thing we're probably gonna get some of is bones. Oh, did I do it again wrong? in the system. <laughs> okay, that's better. So I lost some bones on that, but that's fine. And well that's why I lost them. <laughs> All right, uh, now, gunpowder. Oh, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to add one more, one more to this. So let's add another section here quick. Oh, I gotta sleep. I don't wanna have any mobs show up on me. I got all the mob sounds off because of this. This darn uh, mob trap is very, very noisy if you're standing right next to it doing redstone. Or doing anything else, in fact. Fortunately, this system is pretty easy to add to. You just have to remember how to do it. So you can add like that. I need...
No, I'm my bricks right there. So we're gonna remember this exact pattern. I need to go make another comparator. If it worked out perfectly the first time. Well, you just you wouldn't have any fun with it. So I think I brought my quartz with me just in case. Doop 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 and doop. There's one more comparator. Now I need one more of these bad boys. And that should probably do okay now. Yeah, I, I added onto this and I forgot to add, like in my creative world, I added onto it and I forgot to add one of these. Because it's pretty easy to miss that when you're you're not so good at redstone. Like I'm no uh, Seth playing or anything. I usually just figure out what I want to do and derp around until it works. So now we want our... There. So we got our rotten flesh, our gunpowder, bones, and our arrows. So that's what our chests are going to be. And, and this is a trap chest, so I need a regular chest, and I have one good. Ah, don't want to fall off the edge, don't want to fall off the edge. <laughs> okay, so this should all work now, but um, let's just do a little testy test. So how this all works that we just set up here is uh, we can put stuff in that chest or it just drops. But this first chest is going to be, like these first four are going to all be sorted. And this is just your leftover chest over here. So it should happen when I go like, oh, that's another thing. I want to change this to a trap chest. <laughs> so. We go trap chest now. So now when I put stuff in here, it won't just automatically go away right away. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Arrows, iron shovel, iron shovels. Now, now see it's all working here. So everything's going through. Hopefully this is all working out properly. Let's just do a test. None of that, none of that, none of that. And yeah, so we're getting a bunch of redstone here. So that's good. So far it's working properly. Um, another thing I wanted to do, but I didn't bring a bucket of lava with me, but... So I'm going to have to go get that, so... I'll do a nice little jump cut there and go get our bucket of lava. Ah, be right back. So... That happened. Final score. Yeah. So... This is the end of this series as a uh, as a series series, but like I said, I'll probably be taking this world and uh, adding it to a uh, building world. So it was a fun run, but yeah, ah, disappointing. Okay, guys, seeing as I just totally fell off the edge in a non-spectacular way. I thought I'd show you at least what I was going to do 
before I uh, had died. So what I did wanted to show you was this uh, garbage chest. What it does is just destroys all the items put into it. Here's a bigger sorting system, of course, as I uh, don't think I've shown you guys this, but this is Creative World sorting system, so it's got four chests worth of stuff to be sorted instead of just a single chest like I was showing in my other world. And this is how you can extend it very easily to make it hold as many items as you want. Um, so anyway, let's get to the uh, redstone on this. It's very simple. What you do is you take your dropper and you can put it over a cactus or like I have here or you could do a lava bucket like I was going to do in my other world. So obviously the dropper just goes straight down like this. Now, all you need to do now is just have a redstone there and there, I believe it is. You can see this makes a redstone clock. It's one of the fastest ones. See, so I'll just get a stack of something. Oh, sorry, that's a comparator that I need. Not redstone. Yeah, so. See how it just throws it right away. Fastest clock you can get. So yeah, there's a little bonus redstone thing that uh, I didn't invent that, but it's pretty simple and fast. See there were 64 items and that's how fast I took them. So uh, alright, that's it for my Minecraft Hardcore series for real. If you guys enjoyed it, um, leave a like. Uh, it's always fun to see somebody just drip themselves to death. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Still a little salty about that. Kind of hurts. Alright, guys. That's it for my Minecraft uh, hardcore mode. Um, hopefully I'll be doing something uh, else quick. Maybe a mod or a, a server play soon. Um, if you're looking forward to that, subscribe so then you can see it. And otherwise, uh, leave a like and a comment. You know I love the verbal abuse, even though I haven't got any yet. I feel like the internet's just a nice, cozy, lovable place right now. So, anyway, thanks again. Bye-bye.